Welcome to the Rick and Bubba Show. You got 30 seconds. Go ahead. Yeah, I just wonder who cut the grass at the uh, witch circle in Colorado. <laughs> I'm sure someone was, was assigned to that. Uh, maybe, maybe the week you say, hey, if you're one of the Wiccans, say it's my turn to cut the grass. I don't know. <laughs> the other, the rocks, whatever they do. David, David, and uh, unlike the other one, we can understand what you're saying. <laughs> David listening to 104.7 WZZK. Go ahead, buddy. Hey, uh, what y'all want to know? Uh, I'm, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. We, were, we are doing a phone troll. What, what's, what's the topic? Well, uh, y'all, y'all were talking earlier about Wiccans and people wanting to know about it, so I tried to call in, but couldn't get through. So oh, back in the Wiccan segment. Some of, it, oh. some of you heard that yesterday. Others, it was a few hours ago. So are you a practicing Wiccan? Uh, yes, I am. I have been for 28 years. Yeah, I think we got most of the uh, the questions answered uh, uh, after that. Is there anything you heard that you disagreed with? Well, actually, one of my friends at the shop heard it and gave me a call. I always had to shot home. Uh, one of the things I had heard mentioned is that they said they were checking on the internet saying that we can don't believe in God if we do. Well, what God do you believe in? Well, we believe in the God that created everything on earth. And, <laughs> and everything. It's just a different way of looking at it. But, but I don't understand what you mean by that. I mean, so if, if, if God says and you believe in Yahweh, you believe in Jehovah, you believe in the great I Am, is that the God you're talking about? Well, no, because Wiccans don't believe that the Bible is entirely accurate. So they go by what they see in nature. So, what, so Well, that goes back to what we said. Then you worship the earth then. No, we worship God, but we look at what God has created, which would be nature, and use that as a step. Uh, for how we would see God. So, so you think there is a creator, you just don't subscribe to the historical accounts uh, of the Old Testament or the or the uh, Torah. Well, exactly. And, so, I, and, and I guess Jesus, y'all don't even go there at all, right? No. Well, I'm, I'm, you know, you could use Jesus Christ as, as a deity form, uh, also very, uh, as the male and female aspects of it, but in general... Uh, By the way, uh, you've already said enough to say that's a no, because everything you've just said is blasphemy. So during this segment, I pretty much had my nuts handed to me. Uh, I thought that Rick and Bubba might actually uh, be a little bit more open to it, but they weren't. I tried to explain a basic outline. was a little nervous, never called in to a radio show before. But uh, they were talking about how Wiccans smell, and they don't bathe or brush their teeth, and stuff like this, and making fun of our religion, you know, and this is to be expected by most Christians as a whole, that's pretty much what the way I feel that they did, and they called me blasphemer and all this stuff, but, you know, uh, their website's www.rickandbubba.com, if you want to, send them an email, they're also here on YouTube, and let them know what you think, and try to educate these poor people, but this is what I run into when I try to talk to Christians, so, blessed be, merry part, y'all have a nice day.